Hi and welcome to the end of day eight. Today started very early, 8 a.m. checkout and off to Brooklyn for breakfast. We found a creperie online. In light of yesterday's losing streak, we called ahead to make sure they were open, although nobody answered. We'd hoped this was because they were busy. However, we arrived to find out that they were in fact closed. By this point, we began to understand that most businesses in the city had closed for the holiday weekend. Back on the phone, we called ahead to Lean Crust and success. Our call was answered. We confirmed they were open and yes, they did accept Bitcoin, so we anxiously headed over. Upon arriving, however, we were informed that nobody at the restaurant knew how to use the Bitcoin payment system. So again, we were turned away. Giving up on restaurants, we turned our attention to Green Avenue Market in Brooklyn. With our track record thus far, stocking up at a market sounded like a great idea. We were pleasantly surprised to find both a wide variety and a welcoming staff. Our next stop on the way to town, we headed over to Queens to meet up with Jonathan Mohan, co-founder of Bitcoin NYC, New York's massive Bitcoin meetup, boasting nearly 2,000 members. We talked Bitcoin for just over an hour, then Jonathan was kind enough to share some of Queen's rich history with us. By late afternoon, we were on the road to Philadelphia. One thing we'd learned in New York was a workaround that would let us pay toll booths in Bitcoin, but more on that later. And now for the breakdown. Today we spent 0.439 Bitcoin, approximately $165 US. We traveled 130 miles, about 210 kilometers. Our friends network grew by a factor of two and we received three more donations today. Thank you very much. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and join the conversation on Twitter. See you tomorrow.